With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello student, let us start with the question. Here we have given the angle of elevation of a jet plane from a point A on the ground is 60 degree and after a flight of 30 seconds, the angle of elevation changes to 30 degree. If the jet plane is flying at a constant height of 3600 under root 3 meter then find the speed of the jet plane so let us start with this solution first of all what is given to us we have given there is a jet plane who is flying at a constant height of 3600 under root 3 meter so let this is the plane that is e this is the first position of the plane e which making an angle of elevation to the ground that is nothing but 60 degree now the plane is uh, traveling okay Tra plane is flying actually for 30 seconds after 30 seconds the plane position will become something he over here let this is the second position of the plane that is d and from this position the angle of elevation is changes to 30 degree now if we will look at the diagram so the height of the plane a will be the same I, it is given into the uh, question that is with a constant height means if EB will be 3600 under root 3 then DC will also 3600 under root 3. Now if you look at here so ED is nothing but the distance which is covered by the jet plane uh, in flying in the sky and uh, while uh, this distance is nothing but covered into the 30 second and as we know that as we know that the distance is nothing but is equals to velocity into time right velocity into time so can i write ed as vt can i write vd as vt now here i will do some consideration that is let the velocity of the plane is nothing but v while the time taken by the plane to travel the distance from e to d is nothing but t okay now similarly i will uh, now if we will look at the diagram so here is forming nothing but two kinds of triangle one triangle is a e b second triangle is a d c so we will talk about these triangles and try to find the velocity of the plane. So let us start with the first one. So in triangle B E A, in triangle B E A means this triangle. If I will talk about this triangle now, here A B, here whatever the A B is here, let this is as Y. Now the opposite side of the rectangle are nothing but equal. Hence, ED is VT. So, BC will also become VT. And if this is 3600 under root 3, then this will also be 3600 under root 3. Now, I want to, uh, now here I am looking in the triangle BEA. That is this triangle. So, in this triangle, I can say that cot 60 is nothing but is equals to adjacent upon hypotenuse. So, adjacent is nothing but that is sorry adjacent upon up, upon opposite not uh, hypotenuse adjacent upon opposite adjacent is nothing but y here and opposite is nothing but given to us 3600 under 3 now i will take this term to that side and cot 60 is nothing but as we know that 1 by under 3 so this will become 600 under 3 into 1 by under 3 will be nothing but is equals to y from here i will get the value of y as 3600 meter let this is equation number one now i will try to to see in the second triangle that is in bigger triangle ADC let in triangle ADC what I can write I can say that cot 30 
is nothing but is equals to adjacent upon opposite so if you look at to addition is nothing but ac and ac is nothing but combination of y and vt so here i can write the adjacent is nothing but y plus vt divided by opposite is given to us that is 3600 under root 3 now i will take this 3600 under root 3 to that side and cut off uh, 30 is nothing but how much under root 3 so it will become 3600 under root 3 into under root 3 which will be nothing but is equals to y plus vt now as we have calculated the value of y at 3600 so i will put the value of y here as 3600 meter plus v and the value of t is nothing but given to us that is t is equals to 30 second okay this is known to us this is given to us so here i will put the value of t as 30 and similarly when we multiply under tree under tree so it will become 3 so here i will get 3600 into 3 now i will solve these equations so i will get the value of v so this 3600 goes to that side so here it will become 30 v is nothing but is equals to 3600 into 3 minus 3600 which will be nothing but is equals to so here i will get the value of v is nothing but is equals to how much 3600 into 2 divided by 30 now this 0 0 will cancel 3 1 the 3 3 1 the 3 3 2 the 6 so 120 into 2 will be nothing but 240 and the unit for velocity is nothing but meter per second and it is asked in the question to find the speed of the jet plane so here is the speed of the jet plane that is 240 meter per second i hope you will like the solution thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today